Hey guys, welcome to Let's Play FTL Fast and Light. I'm Nye. We're going to take a break from the bulwark because we've been doing that a lot as of late. And uh, we're going to... I'm trying to decide between the Zoltan and the Stealth Cruiser. Uh, the Stealth Cruiser really appeals to me. We're just not having luck with that. I'm going to go with the Zoltan Cruiser. We haven't done it in a while. I like the Zoltan Cruiser. Uh, so we're going to do this. And, uh, you know, we're still going to hope for the... Um, we're still going to go for... Uh, the other two ships that we have uh, yet to get. So, you know, we can't really, um... The... Uh... Ba -ba 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 Ooh, that's a nice start. Uh, the other two ships that are not the crystal ship we're gonna go for, we know how to get them, sort of. We just need to actually do it. So, you know, we got to get to either the Slug Homeworld or the Mantis Homeworld, and we have to, um, deal lots of damage. No, uh, we have to either teleport onto the enemy ships, or we have to, um, excellent. We need to teleport onto the enemy ship, uh, to get the Mantis and kill the crew members, or we need to, for the Slug, do basically the same thing. So I'm gonna need a crew teleporter, pretty much no matter what I do. I did get the whole, sla uh, whole Smash Laser Mark II. That was a great first get. Okay, two missiles, drone parts, and 11 scrap. Why couldn't I get such luck on uh, missiles, you know, for... Um... For the uh, Bulwark, you know? Okay, let's defend this outpost. Take out its shields. Uh, I'm not too worried about its weapons, to be honest. Okay, that did negligible anything. It might get through my full shields. Possibly, possibly but... Uh, not amazingly terribly worried. You get over here. does confuse me is why its shields didn't go down. I kind of forgot that uh, uh, this ship has those uh, level 2 doors, which are just amazing to have this early in the game. Oh, is this still? Oh, that's still closed. Okay, that's, that explains why air didn't escape. Okay, what's well, fine. That fire's not going to go anywhere. And there we go. Okay. Doing good so far. Three fuel. Awesome. Another fuel, two missiles, and 14 scrap. That's pretty good. I'm going to uh, upgrade that twice. And I'm going to do this. So that should give me a 25% dodge chance. Uh, and I'm going to do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have that dodge chance while we have our basic shield up. And then I will... Uh, change from the bait, or, and then I'll just get my shields active as soon as that finishes. We're gonna see how well that works. I'm not sure how well that strategy is actually gonna pan out, but what we're really looking for right now is a fourth crew member, so that way I can get uh, our guys off, um, or I can get that last Sultan off the cockpit, which will allow me at least one more, um, one more power without having to upgrade my uh, reactors at all. Okay. Gonna hold on to this scrap for now. Gonna skip the store because there's no need to go there just yet. And keep on moving. Uh, offer our services, but we're not properly equipped because we don't have a teleporter, which sucks. But I don't have anybody to put in a teleporter right now, anyways. Got another fight. That's fine. We'll just slag their engines as we take out their shields. Unfortunately, the halberd beam takes so damn long to charge. Come on, halberd beam. Excellent. So that's delayed. They're not going to be getting through my shields anytime soon. And this next swipe should take them out. So doing good, uh, you know, it's not uh, too hard to do the uh, strategy behind the Zoltan ship. We're getting plenty of fuel. 
through. I'm gonna hit the Distress Beacon, but we we seldom see Distress Beacons that Zoltan can, uh, can solve on their own, which is kind of weird, actually. Hopefully it'll be one of Beam we'll work on, though. I will give these guys fuel. Doesn't really get me much, though. I'm probably gonna wish I didn't do that. I'm gonna reject the offer here, and instead... I'm going to set this up. Uh, that beam weapon's gonna give us a little bit of trouble, but uh, their basic laser over there, not worried about it at all. They may get through my normal shields, but or my uh, Zoltan shields. But, uh, you know, I, I don't really anticipate having much trouble with them in the first place. Yep, that takes care of that. So their beam weapon is going to be able to get through my uh, Zoltan shields. And I'll just pop up my regular shields and we'll be fine. And my beam weapon is... They're going to offer me 5 fuel, 5 missiles, and 10 scrap. I'm not going to accept that. Uh, if, if this was the bulwark, you know, hell yeah, I need those missiles. It's fantastic. But, um... Not on this ship. I don't use Lido enough. Lays through, fantastic. And get another fuel missile and 15 scrap. It's the scrap I want right now. I'm gonna make my way to the exit. Not gonna risk it on this run. Uh, I will attack the ship to get to the storage cache though. That sounds like a jolly good idea. Okay, I like I love having this uh, Zoltan shield for the first sector or so because it just makes life easy, uh, especially if you if you use it the right way. Okay, and that took care of that. That was an easy thing, and the station gives us uh, lots of good stuff. On our way into sector two. Investigate the intelligent life forms, try to communicate peacefully. They give us a free NG. And now we have an extra uh, extra bit of energy to use. So I'm going to upgrade my engines again. Ah, crap. No. Okay, you go in here. I was going to have to trade him back and forth, depending on what I need. Okay, so let's go... Um, I'm gonna go to the Uncharted Nebula because one of those two nebulas is gonna be uh, the Slug Home Worlds, and we want to go there. So, I'm gonna do that. But what that means is I'm gonna need a crew teleporter, which means I'm gonna need a crew. And I will also need to upgrade my sensors because apparently that's needed uh, to get the uh, to get the Slug ship. But more important than that right now is having a crew that can do something. Because Zoltan are not good fighters at all. Kind of sucks, but, you know. Tempted to uh, just let these guys, you know, uh, asphyxiate, but it doesn't look like they're going to play ball that way. That's fine. I'll just destroy them. I do, that, I do have that lovely hull smasher laser, which I haven't started using yet. Oh, they got through my shields. I did not even notice that. Took a little bit of pointless damage, but that's fine. 22 scrap. Didn't get anything. I uh, didn't get any weaponry, because apparently we destroyed it all, but that's fine. You know, again, not worried about it. Uh, let's attack these pirates as well. These ones, I'm going to do like this, just because I do not want to... Um, actually, I'm going to do it like this. I do not want to see them teleporting onto my ship when my shields go down. If they go down. And they have a pretty decent set of weaponry, so yeah, there's a chance my shields could go down from this. Yeah. My shields are going to go down pretty quick. Okay, there goes that. Here comes my regular shields. So they teleport onto my ship. Uh, they're attacking my NG, which I don't appreciate. So I'm just going to get my NG out of there. And we're going to uh, let these guys try to get away. They're going to try to offer me 3 fuel, a drone part, and 12 scrap. Not quite worth it to me, honestly. 
So we're going to fight my NG in there. I'm going to take a point out of um, oxygen, I guess. And uh, let my NG fight it out. Albert Beam should take care of them on this go. Okay, three fuel, two missiles, and 13 scrap. A little bit better than what they offered me. Let's get that NG up, uh, healed up real quick. Got 111 scrap that I don't really want to use just yet. I really want to save it and get, you know, cloaking device or something. Okay, so they immediately fire on me. Will whoop de freaking do. Uh, they do have a lot of missile-type weapons. Uh, I'm not... not liking that. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do... That. No, change my mind. Again. I want to take out their O2. Okay, good. Our 30% evade chance is doing, uh, is doing wonders. Their oxygen just went offline. They did just take out my actual shields, though. And I have an incoming laser, which is going to hit, unfortunately. Okay, intruders detected. They are in the sensors room. Which sucks. Okay, you just stay there. I don't care. Okay, they're fighting in the exact right direction to not get anywhere. They're trying to destroy our doors, which is not going to work. They leave behind a crap ton of nice stuff. They're just going to open up all the doors. They're going to die eventually. Yep, they're gone. Okay. Close the doors, get oxygen back in the ship. Uh, I'm not seeing a store anywhere, and I would really like to see a store somewhere. Let's see. Got a, yet another one of these fights. Can I finagle? No, I can't. Okay. Well, that sucks. I was trying to. I was trying to get like a teleporter into uh, shields beam, but that's you know obviously not going to happen. Now they should have a decent, uh, decently hard time actually getting through my shields. Those lasers are not going to get through my shields. I can say that with reasonable certainty. Uh, they're not going to get through my, like, real shields. They may get through my Zoltan shields, which, uh, you know, oh well. But uh, I shouldn't be taking any damage off of this fight. Yep, there you go. They go out. We move on. Still looking for a store. Really need to start seeing some uh, fuel. Okay, got an easy fight here. One beam's gonna do it, and we're not gonna take any damage. I say that with reasonable certainty. Come on, Halberd Beam. There we go. We're making it a long ways without doing upgrades, without, uh, you know, without using the Halberd Beam. I mean, without, um, you know, uh, upgrading our uh, reactor, which, you know, I don't think we're going to make the Sector 5 without upgrading the reactor, but uh, so far, we're doing good. Now let's go right there to right there. Now, once we start seeing level 2 shields, it's all going to go kind of out the window and have to start using the hull laser instead of the halberd beam. But um, I don't anticipate seeing those until at least the next next sector. This guy's probably going to fire. Okay, there's the fire again. Is that going to miss? No, that's going to hit. Um, based off of the weapons he actually has online, I'm not going to turn my shields on just yet. Which is good, because they're down. Um, excellent. But yeah, there was no point turning on my shields just yet. There really wasn't wasn't going to do anything for me. What I am going to do is level up shields to level 2 because then I can shunt power from engines to shields if it's needed. Here, we're going to let uh, 
Let's actually get the shields up, uh, powering up. I'm going to save that 151 for the next shop and uh, hopefully get something interesting there. Awesome. You get back in there. You get back in there. And uh, get the halberd being back online. Okay. I'm going to start making my way in this direction. Uh, let's attack this automated ship to get to the station and get the this beam or this thing getting uh, their shields offline so for instance this is going to be the type of ship that I'm going to want to get my level 2 shields so uh, to give you some example how did that miss I want you to explain to me how that went down oh hello crap problem yeah that you guys get in here real quick. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I. Their ion got this really lucky hit on me, which irritates me. Okay, their shields are now offline. And they shouldn't be able to get through my shields. All laser. Excellent. Okay. Their laser, I don't give a damn about. I don't care about that beam weapon. It's not going to get through. Wow, this thing's dodge chance. It's kind of incredible. We're only hitting about 50% of the time. I mean, it's understandable, but it had level 2 shields, so to have that high, yeah, to have that high of dodge chance is kind of nuts. Let's investigate the station, got some more scrap, and got a functioning drone schematic. Get you guys into there. Okay, let's make another jump. Um, I'm kind of worried I'm backing myself into a corner here. Let's attempt to follow these guys. We got some friendlies. Unfortunately, it's only an NG. I was hoping for something uh, that could fight. Okay, what do we find? Let's engage this rebel ship. Why not? Okay, because we're not going to catch them. That's why not. Let's go jump into this store and see what we get. I'm going to sell the boarding drone immediately. Uh, I can get the crew teleporter, which I will buy. I'm not going to buy drone control. I will upgrade, or I will, uh, repair my ship, and I will buy a ton of fuel, and that's gonna be it. Now it's time to leave. I'm kind of worried I'm not gonna make it. This is a plasma storm. Um, I'm gonna arm my weapons. I have enough power to make this happen. That's a hull laser. Uh, do I want the hull laser? No. I want the halberd beam for this one. Okay, we're going to have to watch things very, very closely here. I don't think they have the power to punch through my shields, but they're going to get power from me taking down systems, and that could cause issues. Come on, miss, miss, miss. Good. That's going to give me a chance. They're offering me five fuel, two drone bars, ten scrap. Not going to accept it. I just got a ton of fuel. I do not need that much right now. Okay, I'm going to jump to this beacon, and then I'm going to jump to the exit. That's how I'm going to run this. And there's absolutely nothing in this beacon, so, you know, whatever. Exit. Okay, let's aid the civilian ship here. Uh, let's, uh... Aim this like this. Good. Okay. Pretty decent stuff here. Uh, they're probably not going to get through my shields. Just looking at it, based on the weapons they have, they have a, a hull laser. All right, not a hull laser, but a heavy laser, a one very light beam weapon, and a bomb of some sort. Uh, and, I mean, that's it. Um, they might get through my shields right now. 
Get these guys jumping over here. And now we have level 2 shields, and that's going to be the end of it. Uh, we're not going to see any damage off of this. Excellent. And that goes their ship. That that goes their ship, yes. Uh, there goes that ship, is what I was trying to do. Got a survivor coming. Now we have a human that we can use, which is good. Um, you guys get back over here. So we have a human. Uh, I can toss the human into the crew teleporter and the NG into the crew teleporter. I'd rather have anything but an NG. Okay, we're going to go to the Mantis homeworlds. So this is going to be a bit problematic. So I need, right now, level 2... Uh, actually, I'm going to do level 2, and I'm going to do level 2 there. What I need... Okay, here's a distress beacon. What's in here? Cut the ship out, get two fuel, drone parts, and a lot of scrap. That's good. Okay, we could get the Mantis ship here. I have all the requisite parts. Uh, I just... I have all the requisite parts to get the Mantis ship. I just don't have the... Um... I don't have the raw power, like, fighter-wise, to actually kill all the guys on their ship, which is a requisite detail. see what happens. Okay, good. That missed. Dealt some damage to them, which is good. Their Hermes missile is still up, but uh, they still can't get through my shields, even with that Hermes missile. So, uh, I have at least one more shot of the Halberd Beam before I have to worry. Okay. Fire off. Um, it's a Hermes missile that could still... If that hits, I'm taking a lot of damage here. I'm gonna... It's only the Hermes missile, though, so what I'm gonna do... Okay, it missed. Halberd Beam should take care of it. I'm gonna open up these doors. Okay, I took care of them. Uh, my door control got a little bit damaged, but, um... Uh, where are these guys going? Okay, um, they're going... Let's close those doors and open these ones. You two get out of here and go fix this door control. Because I want to let the air out here and get them out of there. Okay, where are they going to go now? Okay, now they have to fight their way out of there, which is good. You two get in here. Uh, shut to power from there into med bay. Okay, that's working pretty well. And even if they do get into the med bay, we're just going to wreck them in there. Good. Wonderful. Okay, close the doors, let the air go back to where it needs to be. And get you guys back in there. So they got a little bit of experience in fighting. Unfortunately, all the, exper all the experience went to the wrong guy. Which sucks. Okay. Let's uh, pry open the pod. We got another human, which is good. So now we have a fighting for... We actually have fighters on the side. I was hoping for a mantis. I won't lie. Okay, here's a store. I saw the distress beacons. We're going to go there next. But this store is a little bit more important right now. Do I have anything to sell? No. I want that cloaking device. Damn. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy... Try and decide how I want to buy... What I want to buy. Um... Nothing for now. I'm going to wait. Let's go to this distress beacon. It's probably going to be the uh, ship we're looking for. Nope. Still looking for that distress beacon. Looks like I'm not going to find it. Yeah, and got ourselves another fight here. Uh, I need the hull laser for this one. 
Now what I could do... Now these guys have way too many weapons for that. Just gonna wait for the whole laser to punch through, hopefully get rid of their shields. Yeah, these guys have a lot of weapons. Wow, look at this. And we miss. These guys are kind of in try-hard mode here. And you two get over here. Uh, you get in here. Teleport these guys over here. Wow, I cannot believe that actually hit something. Wow, we're taking a lot of damage. Okay, I don't actually want this fight. That's the thing. I have no interest in this fight at all. Uh, let's put this right here. Like, we're taking damage for... And I'm not... We're not taking damage for any reason. That's the thing. You get over here. This is, this is not a fight I like. That's the thing. Okay. Okay, good. You guys did that. Let's get you guys. Where are the enemy? Are they in here? Yes. Okay, it's one Mantis. We should be able to kill him. With not too much trouble. Good. Three fuel, two missiles, 39 scrap. Uh, took more damage than I would have wanted to. But, um... Doing pretty okay here. Uh, I'm, I'm sitting here thinking, you know, what is the best cause for the good of the run? What are we in? We're in Sector 3. We need to be in Sector 5 to get the achievement for don't upgrade your, uh, don't upgrade your reactor. I'm trying to decide basically what the better part of Valor is. Is it worth risking the run? to get that achievement. Considering if I do risk the run, I might not even make it there anyways. Okay, I'm just gonna jump over here just in case one of these other spots nearby is the uh, spot I'm looking for. Okay, we got hostiles on the ship. You two get down there. I need a fourth guy in here. Whoa, this guy, wow, he took a lot of damage really fast. Okay, uh, you get in there. You get in there. You get in here. You get in there. Actually, you know what? That's what I'm gonna do. This is dangerous as hell. But, uh, what I need to do is open these up. So I need to get them out of that room. Preferably dead. Okay, this is how we're gonna do this. Right. Okay. Don't need that. I'm gonna put points into that. Okay, let's close off doors. Wow, are you kidding me? Uh, crap. I did not realize exactly what level of stupid we were dealing with here. You get in there. You get... You two get in here. Wow, look at this. Okay, need points out of that, need points into that. Uh, crap. I'm, I'm trying to make this work, I really am. Okay, you get in here, get the weapons back online. You two get in here, get the shields. Wow, oh, yeah, he's gonna jump, I can't stop him. I'm not even willing to stop him, that's the thing. I mean, that's the deal here. I'm not willing to stop that guy. You get out of there. Again, I'm sitting here in my head are the words, you know, the good of the run. That's what's playing right now. In 
part of me wants to try to race to Sector 5 and just get there as fast as humanly possible. Just screw any other enemies, you know, just jump, 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 jump. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking that's probably the best way to run this at this point. You get in there. You two get back in there. The thing about getting that achievement is that I'm not going to really have the scrap to do really anything else. Okay, um... I need energy in the engines. So I'm gonna do this for now. So I'm gonna hit this quest marker and then I'm gonna hit the exit. And it's a trap. laser on uh, that. No, on these. You two teleport into here. Let's see what they have. I see a human. No one else is showing up. That's concerning. Oh, it's because, okay, it's because they have a med bay. Well, that fixed that problem right quick. My guys are still taking plenty of damage, which is not good. I'll take a point out of O2, get these two healed up. So I blew up their um I blew up their drone, which was good, but they just spawned another one, and we weren't able to get a hit in on their shields, which is what I was hoping to do. Okay, you guys get back in there. Looks like we did, however, get a hit on, or we did a breach in their shield room, which they're gonna need to take care of. Nope, that missed. Okay, come on, get me, get me the whole laser in there, come on. Good. You two, pull back. You get in there. Like, this is a very back and forth fight, because just it's the same sort of the same sort of fight every time. They're gonna get that. Yeah, they they have a uh, they have to have a ship repair drone in there. And there's not really much I can do against the ship repair drone, honestly. Well, I can throw these guys in here. I can destroy them. There's not really anything the uh, enemy can do about that either. It's kind of a waste of my time, but it also means they don't like they can't use the ship repair drones to repair the uh, med bay if I destroy it in a second. There we go. Okay another hull breach too which is good now I should be able to win the fight in here get my guys out of there fast before anybody shows up to kill them okay how are my guys doing pretty decent they want to get out. They're not happy with what I'm doing to their ship. Okay, you guys get over here. So I'd really appreciate stopping them from getting out of there. I don't know how it's still charging, even with uh, us killing their guy. Yes, we got there just in time. Took them out just in the nick of time. That was pretty fantastic, if I do say so myself. Juggling those guys like that was just absolutely... It was obnoxious. That I will say outright. It was an obnoxious fight to have to juggle. Was not a fan of it. Ready to move on. We should have just enough time to get to the exit and get the hell out without having another fight in our hands. Uh, Let's be a hero.
Let's attack. They have level 2 shields, and they have healing. So uh, I'm going to start off just by trying to stop that. So I want to get rid of their rid of their healing. If I can get rid of their healing, then I will launch my men in there, and we'll see about uh, we'll see about stopping that. Come on, hole laser. Ow, taking damage. Okay, you two. In here. I'm talking about you two in here. Level two shields activate. So I badly need to see level two shields up. Okay, can I? can't really risk throwing my guys over there. That's the thing. Can you get back up here? Give me a dodge chance, for Christ's sakes. Close these off. Okay, we should be good. But, like, this is... This is risky as all get out. Because if even one thing hits me, I'm boned. Okay, um... Why did I do that? That was really stupid of me. Well, that's it, guys. Uh, not a good run for the most part. Just trying to go for the do not upgrade your ship at all achievement is really, really ridic ridiculously difficult. So, to get to Sector 5 without upgrading your reactor in this old tanker is very, very ridiculously difficult. Uh, I think we have to get a lot of Zoltans uh, as, like, rewards or as purchased from what, uh, ships in order to actually be able to pull that off. So, um, you know, there's that. Uh, I'm probably, next time, going to do the Zoltan ship again, and I'm going to once more go for all power, and that should help. Okay, guys, I'll see you next time.